Leaving Neverland, Michael Jackson and Me, Part 2 airs tonight, Thursday, March 7, on Channel 4. Part 1 premiered last night, Wednesday, March 6, and you can watch the first episode via Channel 4S On Demand service all for now, Leaving Neverland looks into the child abuse allegations made against Michael Jackson. Jackson and his estate have denied all allegations relating to Al abuse. Leaving Neverland is told from the perspective of two of these alleged victims, James Safecock and Wade Robson. Another boy mentioned in the documentary is Brett Barnes but who is he and why does he not appear in Leaving Neverland? Who is Brett Barnes? Barnes met Michael Jackson in 1987 when he was just five years old. Barnes is originally from Melbourne, Australia and at the age of nine, Barnes and his family were invited to visit the Neverland Ranch. Barnes was regularly seen hanging out with Jackson, Macaulay Culkin and Jordan Chandler throughout the 1990s. According to the 2007 book Be Careful Who You Love, Inside the Michael Jackson case by journalist Diane Diamond, Barnes admitted to visiting the Neverland estate on his own. In the documentary Leaving Neverland Part 1, photographs of Barnes feature at the end of the episode, Wade and Robson speak of their jealousy of Barnes as Michael Jackson started to focus his attention of Barnes and Macaulay Culkin from 1992 onwards. When does Leaving Neverland Part 2 air? Seyfakuk speaks of feeling excluded and said Barnes had replaced him. In the documentary, Seyfakuk said, that was very difficult to handle. There was a lot of jealousy and hurt. You're no longer special. Seyfakuk recalled one night crying downstairs on the couch wanting to go home as Barnes was sleeping in Michael's room instead of him. He described feeling cast out and having a realization that he was no longer the number one. Robson's mother recalled how heartbroken her son was when Robson saw Jackson and Barnes on television during the Dangerous Tour, despite Jackson telling Robson no children were allowed on the tour. Where is Havenhurst House? In 1993, when Jackson was first accused of all misconduct, Barnes defended him. At 11 years old, Barnes told reporters, he kissed you like you kiss your mother. It's not unusual for him to hug, kiss and nuzzle up to you and stuff. He also said that he slept on one side of the bed while Jackson slept on the other. Again in 2005, Barnes testified in a separate trial that Jackson had absolutely not molested him as a child. When asked whether the star had touched him in a well way, he said, never. I wouldn't he stand for it. In 2005, Jackson was tried for 14 counts relating to child al abuse. He pleaded not guilty to all charges and was found not guilty by a jury in 2005. Brett Barnes was last publicly photographed at the 2005 trial and has led a very private life since. Who are James Safecuck and Wade Robson? Why is Brett Barnes not in Leaving Neverland? Director Dan Reed chose not to interview Brett Barnes for Leaving Neverland. Speaking about his decision, Reed told USA Today that Barnes' accounts do not change what happened to Robson and Safecuck. He said, no one else was in the bedroom with them. If there are people out there who were also intimate with Michael Jackson and spent many nights with him in bed that were not molested, that's fine. It doesn't in any way negate the story of these two individuals. Speaking to Business Insider, Reed added, In the end, I knew that Macaulay and Brett had made statements consistently rebutting allegations that were made. I'm not in the business of outing anyone. I think we make it very clear in the film that they deny to this day that anything I'll happened and I'm not about to try to change their minds about that dot in the documentary, a written denial from Barnes features on the screen.
The day after the film premiered at Sundance Film Festival, Barnes tweeted, So people are getting their facts from a movie now? I wonder how they feel about the documentary showing the great alien invasion of 96. I think it was called Independence Day. Leaving Neverland Part 2 airs tonight at 9 pm on Channel 4.